Hello, you're welcome to IDC Learning Center. This is English class once again. So today we are going to be looking at antonyms. Yes, we'll be answering questions on antonyms. Okay, the task in antonyms is for you to define the word that you're giving, the indicated word, and then your answer would be in the opposite okay now for you to answer the questions where there is no true opposite you have to pick the most appropriate meaning and where you have more than two opposites you have to pick the answer that is nearest nearest and opposite to the indicated word so now we'll go straight to the questions Displaying on your screen. Question one says accelerate means the opposite of dash. A you have stop, B slow, C quicken, and D hasten. So first of all, we have to know what the, the meaning of accelerate is. Now I find out accelerate. means to quicken accelerate means to quicken so now what is the opposite of quicken your answer would be the word b which is slow so there you have it b now second question says docile means the opposite of a we have active b we have help c we have probable d we have teachable now docile means The sign mean calm or easily led. So now what will be the opposite of calm or easily led? The correct answer is A, which is active. Question three, candle means the opposite of A, frankness, B, doubt, C, deception, and E, and D, enthusiasm. Now we'll find out the meaning of candle. Candle means frankness. So, its opposite will be the opposite of frankness would be deception, which is option C. So, number four. We have demonic. Demonic means the opposite of what? So we have A, secret, B, anonymous, C, stationary, and D, famous. Demonic means wandering. Wandering. So the opposite of this would be what? Stationary. Which is option C. Stationary. Now the next question. Humble means the opposite of A. Simple. B. 
hurt. C, just, and D, conceited. Now, what is the meaning of humble? Humble means meek and modest. And of course, we are looking at the opposite of meek and modest. That will give you what? Option D as a correct answer. Conceited. Now question six. Defy means the opposite of dash. A. Desire. B. Embrace. C. Fight. And D. Abscond. And we have to find out the meaning of defy. Defy means to challenge. So now, what is the opposite of challenge? If you're not challenging something, of course, you are embracing it. The correct answer would be B, which is what? Embrace. Now, number seven says, Gorge means the opposite of A. Duct, B. Diet, C. Stuff, and D. Valley. Okay, now what is gorge? Gorge means overeating. Overeating, to eat too much. So we're looking for the opposite of this. In the options given, the correct answer which is diet. Now the next question, curtail means the opposite of what we have one curry a curry b open c shorten and d extend curtail is to shorten and of course the opposite of shorten would be extend. Which is option D, extend. Now, number nine, we have initiate. Initiate means the opposite of what? So let's find out the meaning of initiate. Initiate means to start something. To start. Remember, you're looking for antonym, which is the opposite. So the opposite of start would be what to terminate that is to end so you have option C as your correct answer question 10 grant means the opposite of dash grant now to grant
to grant is to give now the opposite of that we have option a confiscate option b money option c land and option d give the correct answer is a confiscate which is the opposite of what of give question 11 clamor means the opposite of dash clamor first thing you do is find the meaning of the given word meaning of clamor is what noise noise now let's look for the opposite of noise option a we have ugliness option b we have beauty option c silence and d dishonor of course the correct answer C. which is the opposite of noise next question rouse means the opposite of dash the given word here is rouse and the meaning of rouse Browse to awaken. Now we're looking for the opposite of awaken. We have A, lull, B, alarm, C, complain, and D, weep. Correct answer. is option A law means to sleep or to lure to sleep okay now question 13 we have credible means the opposite of dash First, let's look for the meaning of credible. Credible means believable. So now the opposite of believable, we have option A, believable, option B, unbelievable, C, honorable and d dishonorable of course your correct answer is option b which is unbelievable question 14 torof means the opposite of what torof Let's find out the meaning of Torof. Torov means complete or everything. You can also say all. So the opposite of this, we have option A, around. Option B, circumvented. Option C, incomplete. And D, inside. Of course, the 
opposite of complete would be incomplete. Option C, incomplete. Question 15, we have wooden means the opposite of dash. Now let's find out the meaning of wooden. So the opposite of stiff or unbending, we have option A, iron, B, slippery, C, robbery, and D, grain. Okay, the correct answer. Correct answer is C, robbery. You can see that robbery is what flexible. Now this is the nearest opposite meaning to wooden or on bending. Okay, now that's all we're going to take for today. All right, I hope you've learned something new in this lesson. Please uh, make sure to check your assignments, visit your page on a daily basis for further instructions. Thank you very much. See you next time. Bye.